Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome to my documentary. I am Fatima Jannat from the Department of Peace and Conflict Studies at University of Dhaka. For the detailed study of the course Human Rights in a Changing World, we have made a documentary on a human rights based organization. This task was given by our honorable course teacher Dr. Saber Ahmed Choudhury sir. Before seeing this documentary, first we need to know what is human rights. Human rights are rights inherent to all human being regardless of race, sex, nationality, ethnicity, language, religions or any other status. According to Jack Donnelly, human rights are literally the rights we have simply because we are human. In 1948, United Nations recognized 30 articles for ensuring and securing human rights is widely known as Universal Declaration of Human Rights. Bangladesh National Women Lawyer Association is one of the renowned organizations who is working with the goal to create equal opportunities and equal rights for women and child. It was established in 1989 and located in Monica Mina Tower 48 by 3 Shui Chhabuddin Jorok West Agargao Dhaka. This 30 years old organization involves more than 100 women lawyers at 64 legal centers at 16 upazila and 64 unions. Advocate Fauzia Korim Firoz, President, Advocate Seema Johor, Vice President Salma Ali as Executive Director of this organization. Main objectives of this organization is prevention, rehabilitation and reintegration. Other objectives are organize women to develop their status in the community, improve women and children domestic, social, legal and economic status, provide justice for all and combat violence against women and children in Bangladesh, create equal opportunities and equal rights for every woman and children in Bangladesh, promote women lawyers of Bangladesh to enhance their scope of profession in the society. BNWLA has contribution in formulation of National Women Advancement Policy 2011 implementation of CEDAW and National Plan of Action on Combating Trafficking of Women and Children in Bangladesh. The development partners of BNWLA are CEDA, Save the Children, USAID, UK8, European Union and others. BNWLA has played an important and significant role with government and other national international development agencies for promoting women and children human rights. To establish women and child rights, BNWLA as an active member of the following committees plays a significant role. Government's NGO Coordination Committee on Counter Human Trafficking under the Ministry of Home Affairs, National Legal Aid Committee under the Ministry of Law, Justice and Parliamentary Affairs, National AIDS Committee under the Ministry of Health, National Child Labor Committee under the Ministry of Labor and Employment. They provide legal service, public interest litigation as a tool of advocacy, networking, advocacy lobbying and social mobilization and shelter service. Prevention and rehabilitation of commercial sexual exploitation and trafficking of children through shelter-based approaches is one of the major projects of BNWLA. Children who are at risk of commercial sexual exploitation, trafficking, sexual abuse and who have already been victimized are the final beneficiaries of this project. For more information and details about this project, I went to Nika Sima ma'am who is an advocate of Bangladesh National Women Lawyer Association. She is a very cooperative and humble person. For safeguarding children human rights, BNWLA involves itself in drafting different alternative reports such as UNCRC, optional protocol of sale of children, child prostitution, pornography and CEDAW. BNWLA plays the key role in execution of SAR Convention on Preventing and Combating Trafficking of Women and Children for Prostitution. 
2002 the formulation of bilateral agreement on combating human trafficking between Bangladesh and India we rescue children from trafficking through the agreement and give them legal and shelter services if it requires we make a case under the section 11 of the prevention and repression of human trafficking act 2002 after the case the law enforcing agencies took it over if the report investigate within 60 working days the verdict of the case is well received in many cases children are also sought under the amendment act 2003 of trafficking and rape act at the end i would like to thank our honorable course teacher dr saber ahmed choudhury sir for giving such opportunity and also thanks to niga sima advocate of bangladesh national women lawyer association yasin bin ibrahim admin officer of bangladesh national women lawyer association